They mourned in Corpus Christi, Texas today. Selena's family, her friends, and her fans said farewell to the young woman who meant so much to all of them. We ask that you also will extend such comfort to the mother and father, the sister and brother, the husband of Selena. Amen. Today's funeral ended a weekend of mourning for the Tejana superstar. More than 30,000 people passed by her casket, so overwhelmed by their grief that they could not speak, only weep. <laughs> Mourning was not confined to her hometown. In Los Angeles, at the very arena where she was to have performed last Saturday night, thousands attended a mass in her honor. They grieved not just for a star, but for a role model. It's been it was like a punch in the heart. We really love Selena. She was really special. She was a very good influence to all the kids. Dancer Alex Restrepo performed in one of her videos. She set a, a very positive example for our youth. And I'm just going to be praying for her. When she was gunned down Friday, allegedly by her fan club president, Selena was one of the biggest stars of the Spanish language music scene, poised for a breakthrough into mainstream pop. She had already sold millions of records and won a Grammy. Thank you. Thank you very much. Her music had become a staple at Spanish language radio station KTNQ in Los Angeles. Fans have placed a memorial outside, and disc jockey Amalia Gonzalez says she will not be forgotten. I have talked to a lot of people and especially children. Uh, they think that uh, Selena was an angel. They came, uh, they came to the, the world uh, to, especially to unite all creeds and races. Ironically, Selena's tragic death brings her the wide recognition that she hoped her music would accomplish. Despite being only 23, Selena leaves behind a legacy of music and hope.